Hi there, this story's title is Amira's Picture Day by Veen Farooqi, illustrated by Farmeda Azim. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Amira peered through the window but saw only the black unblinking sky. Do you see the moon? whispered mom. Ziad scanned the sky and shouted, I think I see it. I see it too, Amira said. Mom drew them in for a hug. That means it's eat tomorrow. Amira felt warm and tingly inside. She couldn't keep still even when she tried. She rushed to bring her mom the mehndi corn. In a few minutes her hands were decorated with wet green swirls and designs. Her mom even doodled her favorite animal, a dolphin, in the middle of one hand with a mermaid on the other. Amira held her hands out carefully to make sure they dried. She hoped that the next morning her mehndi designs would be a deep chocolate brown. Tomorrow we get to skip school, yelled Ziad. Amira cheered. Okay you two, let's use your energy to make some goodie bags, said mom. Amira joined her little brother in counting lollipops for the children at the masjid. A colorful flyer on the fridge caught her eye. Tomorrow was picture day. Amira's cheeks felt hot. Her insides felt cold. She had already chosen her pink striped dress. Miss Bailey had told them that tomorrow they would be taking a group of photos. of the entire to be class mom tomorrow's picture day at school wailed amira don't worry amira we'll take plenty of pictures of you at the masjid in your new eat clothes said her mom ironing amira's shalwar kameez amira knew it won't be the same she loved eid and the party at the masjid but she didn't want to be left out at her class picture how would her classmates remember her If she wasn't there, Amira brushed her thoughts away as she tried to fall asleep that night. The next morning, mom woke her. Eid Mubarak, Amira. Amira traced the mehndi on her hands dreamily. Her mermaid and the dolphin were a deep chocolate brown. Amira smiled as she got out of the bed thinking of all the Eid treats she would get today. Her new Eid shalwar kameez hung nearby. Suddenly she spotted the pink striped picture day dress. The more Amira thought of the picture day, the longer she took to get dressed. When Amira was finally ready, she looked in the mirror. Tiny mirrors on her blue shalwar kameez shone happily in the sunlight. As she was leaving the room, Amira took one last look longingly at her pink striped dress. Mom, are you sure it's Eid today? Not tomorrow. Can I still go to school for picture day? Miss Bailey will miss me. Pleaded Amira. Amira, we saw the moon. It's eat today. Now let's go. Answered Baba. Seeing the masjid, Amira's sadness floated away. Her mouth popped open. She could hardly recognize it. Streamers with stars hung on the wall and colorful balloons decorated the ceiling. Amira swung her basket of goodie bags proudly. She could hardly focus on the melodious Eid prayer. She smelled the fresh scent of just baked cookies. She smiled to herself as she prayed. Right after the Eid prayer, she rushed to her basket and handed out the goodie bags to her friends at the masjid. Lots of mom's friends gave Amira hugs. She made sure to hug them back and wish them Eid Mubarak when she remembered. It was only when her aunt Farah Khala told Amira to smile big for a photo that she remembered picture day. Amira smiled small. After the exciting Eid celebration at the masjid, Amira looked around. A few balloons floated down to the floor. She felt like one of those balloons. If only she had not missed picture day. On the way home Amira closed her eyes tightly to hold back tears. Suddenly Amira had an idea. Holding her breath, she began to count her leftover goodie bags quickly. There were just enough for her class. Mom, Baba, can we stop by my class and deliver the extra goodie bags to them? Her parents' face softened. 
while they exchanged a look. Sure, Amira answered her mom. Do you think I might make it for a picture day? She asked. I'm not sure, mom explained. According to the flyer, two bees photos are in the afternoon. So let's hope you're on time. As Baba and Ziad waited in the car, Amira looked down at her shalwar kameez. She wasn't wearing her pink striped dress for picture day, but she was here at school. Feeling a little funny, she walked stiffly inside. Each leg felt like a wobbly tower of blocks. In classroom 2B, the class was getting busy in line. Had Amira missed picture day? Just in time, Amira said Miss Bailey. I love your outfit. Amira's mom explained to Miss Bailey that today was Eid and that the family had been to the masjid to celebrate this special day for Muslims. As the teacher and mom chatted, Amira handed the basket of goodie bag shyly to her teacher. I like your hands, said Raphael. Your clothes are so colorful. added way you look like a princess gasped regan that's what my name means giggled amira as she skipped into the line what a perfect end to eid as the class stood together in the gym the photographer told them to smile amira did not need to be told to smile she was already smiling thanks for watching For more exciting read aloud stories please subscribe to our channel Little Hearts Super Kids also follow us on Instagram for amazing updates